Uh, Dan, obviously, you heard Coach talking about it, but he mentioned some of the maybe hesitancy you guys had when this install first came in early this week. Can, like, just what was the offense's reaction and your reaction individually when this was presented to you guys? Yeah, I think a lot of guys um, didn't completely believe in it at first because um, it's hard. It's hard to just change your offense in the middle of the season like that. But uh, I have no doubt because – <clears throat> That's what I do, and I'm used to running running the ball wildcat like that. So I was confident, and uh, I, I tried my best to get everybody else on board. What a Christian, and then Henry. Dan, what it's what has it been like to embrace this new role? I mean, you came into Syracuse as a quarterback, but now as a tight end and more of a bruiser. What has it been like to evolve here at Syracuse? You know, it's been a lot of ups and downs. Um, and, you know, like Coach said, I was hurt in the spring, so I really didn't have a complete off offseason. Um, and I'm just – I feel like I'm reaching my stride now, and I'm, I'm really excited to, to have a full off season after the season and really improve. Uh, Henry, then Wyatt. Uh, Dan, you guys have two games left to um, make a bowl game. Do you think this kind of offense you guys run today could help you win future games against Georgia Tech and Wake Forest at all? Uh, that's definitely up to the staff. But uh, I think so. Um, but, uh, again, that's up to the staff to, to decide. Wyatt. Uh, Dan, I know that you had the uh, the play sheet on your wrist, and Dino said that he you guys had a lot of conversations about, you know, just getting you into that role. What were in those conversations? What were they about? And, you know, how did it unfold with the play sheet? Uh, it was just uh, a mix of me running some wildcat, throwing some, some passes, um, making some calls to the line. Um, you know, it was, I, I was pretty used to it. You know, I played quarterback most of my life, so uh, it wasn't that hard of a transition. We'll go to WAER here and then back to Emily in front. Uh, Jaden, this one's for you. To make, I know Dan's from Long Island, but for you to be from North Jersey, to make the biggest play of your collegiate career pretty close to home, what does that mean for you and your confidence back there? Uh, it means a lot because a lot of most of my family was here, so to do it in front of them, to be close to home, and especially a bunch of all of my high school people are watching too. So to to do it right here in the Yankee Stadium was a, a lot, and it built up a lot of confidence. I already had some confidence, but confidence is a lot at, at the position of DB. So confidence, what it really, I mean, it stayed the same. But after I went back on there, it was like I'm trying to get another one. So yeah, we'll go back in front to Emily. Uh, Jaden, can you just kind of walk us through that, that pick six you had, what you kind of saw there on that play and were able to see? Uh, yeah, um, it was just a cover two call, and I was just doing my assignment, and then the opportunity came, so I, I took it and I ran with it. We'll go uh, second row over here. Uh, uh, Jaden, you saw look, your offense was doing what it did all game long with ball control, and they were one yard short of like getting that touchdown before your interception. Did you almost feel as if uh, once you made that play and were able to score that you thought that, hey, this was the momentum shift that you guys needed to kind of salt the game the way, knowing that your offense was, you know, controlling the ball and holding Pitt away from the ball and uh, being able to like gain control of possession? Uh, I mean, yeah, pick six is definitely a game changing play. After we got on the sideline, everyone was happy, especially as me, because everyone treats me as like the little brother. So everyone just everyone was happy for me when I got to the sideline, and it definitely built happiness. And once when the offense will go back out there, and we we already knew we were gonna take off. So yeah. Front row. Dan. Dan, considering you know the position change and the injuries you had. You know, going into camp, uh, off season and into this season, how satisfying is it to have a game like this at home, essentially for you? Yeah, it's it's very satisfying. I had about seventy five uh, people, you know, part of my family and friends in one section, so it was uh, it was cool to to put on a show for them because um, they've always been there for me. You know, in the in the hard times when I was uh, still a quarterback, not playing. So um, yeah, I think. Uh, it was real special to do that here in my home state. Sure. So we'll take a couple more for Dan and Jaden, then turn it over to Garrett. So we'll start right here in the back. Uh, Jaden, what was your reaction to the offense just switching up its entire game plan halfway through the season? Uh, it was definitely eye-opening, but it's not like they couldn't do it because 
I feel like when when you're be able to run the ball down people's throats, it's just like it's nothing you could do about it, even if you know it's coming. So I mean, it was definitely it was definitely eye opening to the defense. So I mean, I mean yeah, but it got the job done. That's all that matters. And then Christian in front for these for other two, and then we'll get to Garrett. Jaden, after starting the season as a backup, what has it been? What does it mean to you to not only get more game time, but also make game changing plays like you did today? Uh, I mean, not starting. It, it, I mean, I didn't really think about it too hard because I knew I'm a guy. I, I, I look up to God, so I know God's gonna have me, and my opportunities will come no matter what the situation will be. So I was just ready for my opportunity, and I just I took it today and just made a play today that came right to me, and I just. Ran the touchdown back. So. All right, I'll let uh, you two go see your family and then quick <coughs> pop out.